if I close my eyes, no problem. Hey loves and welcome back to my channel so today you guys we will be working with georgia's hair so thank you to georgia's hair for sponsoring today's video in these clips here i'm just showing you guys everything that came in the package because they sent me so many goodies but you guys for this hair this wig is a t-part lace frontal 12 inches and if you guys would like to know more information about this wig just stay tuned and keep watching So today you guys we will be working with this t-part lace wig so as you guys can see this unit does not have a lot of lace space so with t-part wigs it kind of just has like one distinct part that you can do so this isn't a side part i'm obviously gonna be doing a side part because it is a t-part wig and you guys can see i just put on some makeup on the lace i literally didn't do nothing to the lace i didn't bleach it i plucked the hairline just to make it a little bit more you know natural the hair looks like it's really fluffy as you guys can see i will be putting some mousse and water and all that good stuff in here so the curls can be much more defined and it's not looking all crazy because right now it looks crazy what i noticed about this wig just before i even put it on my head is like how much lace this has like do y'all see how much lace this has in the front i don't know why it's so much lace like that but i think for this install i will be using some got to be glue i was gonna use spray but i'm like i can use got to be glue so right now i'm just clipping on these clips on the wig and we're gonna put this on my head So you guys can see like look at all this lace oh my god i look crazy right now but look at all this lace on here we're definitely gonna cut this off because it is just way too much so i'm gonna cut this all off i'm gonna get in sections actually i'm gonna cut this lace off by my ear i'm just gonna use this to kind of like hold it down a little bit Cause it's like in my face. Yeah, I look crazy right now. Just, just trust the process, okay? Trust the process. So I'm just gonna cut this off around my ear. Right here. Here. okay so actually before i cut off all of the lace i'm gonna do section by section so i'm gonna pull this back a little bit i'm going to be using my got to be glued for today's install you can make this install completely glueless like no got to be no spray no nothing but i am gonna use my got to be today i'm gonna do this section by section Okay, so I'm gonna let this dry and I'll be right back because you don't want to put this on white. I've done that mistake plenty of times where the got to be wasn't completely dry and it just turned my lace white. So I'm gonna let this dry and I'm gonna apply it section by section. This kind of helped me like easierly, easierly. That's not a word. Just to help me easily apply this wig because you know it's kind of. With T part ways, you kind of just have to like work with this section by section. So it's just easier for me anyway. So I'll be right back. Maybe 95% dry, but I'm just going to start with this section right here first.
Okay, y'all, so at this point, this wig is glued down and it is secure. So that's why I have this elastic band to hold down my edges for the moment. Because, you know, I didn't style my baby hairs yet. But that is soon to come later in the video. <laughs> but for right now, I'm just using my spray bottle because I'm trying to bring these curls back to life. Okay, y'all, because you guys can see these curls is like non-existent but once that water hits it these curls are popping so that's what i really loved about this hair how fast this hair came back to life once you added some mousse and some water you was good to go So now it's time to start these baby hairs and you guys know me and baby hairs we kind of get along sometimes but sometimes they just be giving me a hard time and this time they were they were okay okay so as you guys can see I try to do some dramatic curly baby hairs because I don't know a lot of times with my curly wigs I like to do like dramatic curled baby hairs I just feel like it kind of just makes the hair pop a little bit more you know give a little bit of something you know so that's what i decided to do with this hair and i think they came out pretty good um i do think they were a little bit too thick i definitely could have went back in and plucked them just a little bit more but like i said this is a t-part lace frontal so sometimes it's kind of hard to manipulate the lace because there barely is any lace so you know i kind of was just working with what i what i had so I definitely though could have went in and plucked the baby hairs a little bit more because they were a little thick. But other than that, I think they came out really cute. But I'm telling y'all, these baby hairs took me forever. Like, I think sometimes I'm like a perfectionist. So I like my baby hairs to kind of like be, I guess you can say, perfect. So a lot of times I just go back in and I nitpick stuff. But I think they came out pretty cute. is from Georgius so thank you to Georgius wig for sponsoring today's video first of all can we just talk about this box like look how cute this box is it's like a fluorescent when you order from this company your wig will come in a nice cute little satin bag which I do enjoy every time when I'm done wearing my wigs I never know where to put them the usual wig cap and then you have a little bag of goodies so in here you just have like tweezers bobby pins some clips edge brush and an elastic band this part lace frontal wig and you guys seen how i got this look from start to finish and you guys can, can clearly see like how easy this wig was to install i've seen how simple and easy this look was to achieve i'm really happy with how everything came out seeing i didn't bleach no knots on this hair all i did was literally put makeup on my lace i didn't even pluck um you can always pluck if you would like to kind of give it a more natural look but I didn't really pluck at all. I just plucked like my baby hairs and like that was it. It is a T-part lace frontal wig. So T-parts are just very easy to install. They're very low maintenance as well. So I'm really happy with how everything came out. This is the look that I came up with. I kind of try to be dramatic with some baby hairs as you guys can see. So just kind of make this hair pop a little bit more. I love my baby hairs. Okay, y'all. So y'all know I got to do my baby hairs, of course. So I just kind of did some little cute swirls, some swoops here and there as y'all can see. And I just think it looks really good, you guys. Like, this honestly could pass for my natural hair like that's how natural this hair looks once i put water and some curl enhancing products on this hair it just came back to life the curls are just so pretty so flowy as you guys can see they're kind of like drying up now but i love how this hair looks in the wet state the kind of the look that i was going for you guys seen in the beginning unboxing it, it did look a little crazy <laughs> but once the water hits it you got some curling products some mousse it is good to go you guys if so. you guys are a beginner to wigs t-part lace frontals are perfect for you because you can literally just throw this wig on your head do some baby hair some concealer on your part and you're good to go like 
it's that easy with this wig as well you can make this wig completely glueless but i did decide to use my got to be glue kind of just give me a little bit extra security an adjustable strap sewed into the wig so that as well gives the wig extra security i really love how easy this wig was to install and i just think it looks real cute you know cute little short wig um i do love short hair from time to time this will be perfect for the summertime you know we don't want all that hair on you this would be perfect all information for this wig will be in the description box down below so do not forget to check out my description box and thank you guys so much for watching do not forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video